In Changchun, Zhixin Province, there is a bus line with an operation mileage of 195 kilometers. All of the vehicles in service are full electric buses. From Changchun to Yuxiu, the bus can drive you to the destination with a single charge. This is Changyu Bus Line T388. The passengers from two cities commented, the bus is time-saving and cost-saving. It brings convenience to people's travel. Line T388 makes me feel it is very safe. It is the highlight of Yushu. I had to wait for the bus before. As for the train, sometimes I can hardly catch it. After the bus was open to the traffic, I can go anytime and anywhere. It cost me nine and a half dollars before. Now the price is five dollars and fifty cents. It can save me thirty-one dollars and fifty cents to forty-seven dollars every week. Buses run every twenty minutes. It is comfortable, money-saving, and convenient. Changchun and Yuzhou are located in the hinterland of the Songliao Plain. The unique geographical environment and traffic advantages bring opportunities for the development of two places and surrounding cities and the flow of personnel. Changyu bus line is one of the busiest local passenger lines. However, with the change of travel modes, this busy intercity line also once came across the challenge. This line is one of the main lines we operate. The overall operation condition of the first three to four years was relatively good. But in recent years, the original business performance declined year by year. The decline of the passenger flow was one reason. The most important reason was the passenger diversion. This line was also the most profitable route of our group. And it was the mainstay of our group. The line was completely paralyzed after 2018. The two companies decided to shift the operation from shuttle mode to city bus mode. We researched the possibility of adopting full electric buses. In December 2020, Changshuwen Passenger Transport Corporation and Yuzhu Passenger Transport Corporation jointly carried out a reform on Changshu Intercity Bus Line Line T388 was born. In the first stage, 30 Yutong full electric buses were launched. After the line had been open to the traffic, it quickly won the public's approval. The fifth main reason is the convenience. Another one is the shortened operation time. The last one is the ticket price. The public benefits from it. The two companies run the bus company based on joint operation. Unified accounting, unified vehicle purchase, and unified bus scheduling. This brings a very good effect. After the market survey, we chose the Yutong full electric bus. The quality is very good and reliable. The all-around after service is very popular with passengers. The vehicle running cost is reduced a lot. Before the buses were powered by fuel, but now the buses are electricity powered, which can save about $31 per vehicle each day. The new energy bus does not require maintenance, so it solved a series of problems. A previous fuel-powered vehicle and the vehicle attendance rate also reaches 100%. Corporations has really gained benefit from this bus line, also achieved impressive economic profits What's our next step? We're going to transform some of the surrounding lines, like bus line T388. And has facilitated the travel of passengers and has made contributions actively to the economic development for Changchun as a professional passenger transport corporation. Our vision is to let the people travel better and travel satisfactorily. The connection between these two cities becomes closer. The development of Passenger Transport Corporation becomes more stable. Both social and economic benefits have been achieved. 
there is no end to the road of serving the people. In the future, Line T388 will carry the hope of the public, keep going, and make the happy life longer. <laughs>